Well, we want to give you an update on a fire in the Halls community. It was blazing earlier today. We want to go now to uh, Mary Klingler, who is bringing us up to date on the situation. Mary, last we saw there was um, some flames. Are we are we going to Mary? Well, Robin, right now we are at the bottom of the hill. Crews here, Rural Metro Fire Department is clearing out the scene at this time. They say they've gotten those flames under control at this point. Nothing else to worry about. There's not too much of a threat of this fire starting back up overnight. They've had a bush hog out there working to get the flames from or keep the flames from going up in that brush again. Take a look at some of this video we have from earlier while we were out there on the mountain when those flames were going and that smoke was up in the sky. The wind and the, the dryness out here was a big factor in making those flames spread rapidly. Now we also talked to neighbors who told us that this fire had been blazing for a few days, controlled fire set by the person who may live here. We're not sure and that's not confirmed at the time. This cause of this fire is under investigation. It spanned over 10 acres of land. Two homes were damaged, but no one lives in them, we're told. One camper got a little bit of burn damage, several barns damaged on the property and the surrounding homes were the main concern. That's why this was such an urgent fire to make sure they got under control so that they did not have to get any more of these structures caught up in those flames. Now, right now we are still talking to Rural Metro. They are investigating the cause of this fire and we will of course keep you updated as soon as we learn more. Toss it back over to you. All right, Mary, thank you very much.